Hello guys and welcome back to another video. This is Ray Dunn Halloween haul number three. If you are new here, welcome to Christina and crew. I do a lot of Ray Dunn videos, cleaning, decorating, and now I'm trying to kind of move over to like self-help kind of videos. If it's a topic I know about, I want to share everything I know about it with you guys. So if you enjoy kind of like a hodgepodge of content, I invite you to please subscribe and join my family. So we're gonna jump right into it with our winner from last week. Last week what was up for grabs was sweater weather. I guess I can grab it out of here while I'm chatting with you guys about it. So sweat, sweater weather was up for grabs last week with the green interior. Uh, Miss Candy Cane 82 won that. I'll put the name at the bottom of the screen like I usually do. And I'm super excited because today I'm doing two giveaways, two items. The first item is this travel trick or treat mug. I kept running into these um, in the store. So I was like, you know what? I'll just grab one for the subscribers since I already have mine. You can see it's right there. I said, I'll just grab one for the subscribers and give this away. And since I'm so thankful for you guys and everyone in my community, I'm giving away give thanks. It is like a Merlot purple kind of color, same color all around, super cute. Um, it's not Halloween, but it'll definitely get you in the spirit for Thanksgiving. So I'm giving away these two items. Uh, for this week's question, I think I wanna know what you guys are doing for Halloween this year. I think in most places, there's not gonna be any trick or treating. So I definitely wanna know, are you guys doing like an indoor celebration? Are you gonna kind of keep it with, with family or whatever you're gonna do, let me know. If you don't celebrate Halloween, you can let me know that too. But please make sure you're a subscriber and you leave a comment about Halloween 2020 and you'll be entered to win one of these two. And I'm gonna hang on to this because this is part of the haul. I did um, grab two of them. As promised, I told you guys, if I go in a store and I find more than one of the same item, I will get one for myself and one for you guys. And that's not just limited to um, items that I want. If I find items that are Halloween and I think you guys might want it, I'll grab that too. But anyway, found this this week. This was Marshall's, $5.99. And then I found this really cute boo candle. Normally, I don't go for the candles, admittedly, only because this is $12.99 and the travel mug is the exact same um, price. And I guess I kind of feel like I would get a little bit more use out of the travel mug than the candle, but the kids and I smelled it. Let me see what the notes are. So it's called Harvest Berry. It's not giving really any details about what's in the scent, but it reminds me of the candle I did um, last week for my Bath and Body Works candle haul. Which one was it? That said, it's, it smelled like a fall fruit. This smells like a fall fruit. And I just thought this the back was so fun because you can either decorate with it using the blue side or you could even turn it to this side. So I just thought that was really cute and really fun. Again, retail was $12.99. And for all of you cat lovers out there, I finally found Snickle Fritz a Halloween bowl. I have been hunting because last year I couldn't find any, um, honestly, last year I didn't find a lot of Halloween stuff at all, um, in my opinion. Not like the most sought after stuff, but this year um, I, was, I was able to pick this up. And it's $3.99. And you know what? They had a lot of pet bowls. I've been seeing those everywhere. But I guess I just wasn't sure if you guys were like pet people or how many of my subscribers like animals because I can d include the pet bowls in the giveaways. So if you guys have pets or you love raiding on pet stuff, please let me know in the comments because I can definitely go back and grab some pet bowls um, to give away. That leads me to the most exciting item of this haul, a green magic. And it's like, honestly, I'm starting to think the stores are playing like where's Ray done with the items because I find that if I go directly to the mug section there's no Ray done mugs but if I like really go around the store like section by section I can just find a random one sitting there and it might be around some reefs some fall reefs sometimes it might be near a fall pillow or fall candle but it's, it always seems to be in the most unexpected place so I encourage you guys, if you are Ray Dunn hunting, don't just stick with 
the mugs or the kitchenware section. Try to go around the pillow section. Try the bathroom section. And definitely don't skip the front checkout section because there's always mugs, there's always candles. So I definitely encourage you to just look around the whole store um, if you have the time to really comb through it because you never know what you might find. So those are my items for this week. The Thanks Mug, Snickle Fritz's Boo Bowl, the Boo Candle, and then the Green Magic. So I'm I'm really believing that the Ray Dunn items are kind of just filtering in very, very, very slowly. Because I have this one secret spot, I'm not going to say it, but I have this one secret Marshalls I hit up and I almost always find the rare stuff, like the... Um, the Happy Halloween and the Candy Overload. I found both of those from the same Marshalls and I even asked the sales lady, I was like, do you get a lot of hunters here? And she was like, no, not really. Because when I walked in, I went straight for the Ray Dunn and she was like, well, if Ray Dunn is what you're looking for, that's all we have. So it made me think that she was used to seeing Ray Dunn hunters, which is why I asked her, do you have a lot of hunters? And she was like, well, no, no, not really. But anyway, I'm rambling at this point. Point being, it really is such a commitment to Ray Dunn Hunt for the Halloween stuff. I feel like the Christmas stuff was in abundance. I found so, so, so much Christmas. So much so that I might not even hunt this year. I don't know. And even like for the spring, I was able to get like, I saw some of my mugs up here. I was able to get like plenty of colored mugs for spring. But I don't know what it is about Halloween. I guess we all just kind of go crazy for it. But non-related Halloween items that I did find was uh this queen this is my first ray dunn mug with a topper that is just so adorable i'm just hoping 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 so bad that i can find one of those black hocus pocus mugs with the upside down witch legs mm. and it's like i see this stuff on makari and i'm like I, just, I can't i cannot bring myself to pay 50 dollars for a five dollar mug i just i can't do it and I just feel like, like shame on these people for going in the store and buying every single mug and listing it on a website for 100% more than what they paid. It's just like, <sighs> I know all is fair and love and Ray Dunn hunting, but anyway, so I was excited to find this mug with the topper. Hopefully I'll find a few more. They, there's a, um, a black one, I think. It's all black and it says haunted and it has a haunted house topper on it. That one's cute too. Um, so yeah, I'm hoping that I'll find some of the Halloween topper ones because I'm legitimately hitting like six stores a day. And I even told my husband, like, I don't know how much longer I'll be willing to do this because it is exhausting. You do have to, like, you're going all around and you're, you're finding basically nothing because you guys have to remember, this is my haul for a whole week. So think about doing six stores times five days. And I'm not a mathematician, but that's a lot of time is my point. So anyway, I got basically four or five items for a week of hunting. That's like one item a day. It's a commitment. It's a commitment for sure. But I thank you guys so much for joining me in this video. It means so much for me. Hey, what is that? I, what? I told you I'm making a video. Anyway, it means so much to me for you guys to be here. Um, I know there's plenty of Ray Dunn content you could be watching on YouTube, but you're watching mine, and it means the world to me. Right? You're watching mine, too. Say I'm very, very thankful. Thankful, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Grateful. Grateful. And blessed. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. So I'll be back next Sunday for another Ray Dunn mm -hmm. Hall. Ray Dunn Hall number four. I certainly hope you join me, and there will be another giveaway, right? We love giving away. It's better to give than to receive. Mm -hmm. Yep. So, yeah, we'll see you next Sunday. Hope you guys have a great week. Bye. Bye.